Well, if you're hungry, looking for plans this weekend and hoping to save some coins, well, there's more than 200 places to dig into for Maryland Restaurant Week. WMR2 News' Kara Burnett has the dish on some of the spots to check out. Grab your notepad in appetite because we're checking out some spots for Maryland Restaurant Week. Now, I know this is the Baltimore Museum of Art, but inside is a restaurant that has been around for more than 25 years. You get a little bit of art and cuisine all in one place. It's just become a community center. People have had their first dates here. They've got engaged here. They've gotten married here. They've had the baptisms here. They've had the funerals. They can get a taste of different regional Chesapeake cuisine all in one spot. Ooh, bucatini. It's, nice, it? it's delicious. The restaurant's named after my grandmother, Gertrude. I grew up very close to here. That's where my grandmother lived. And when we came to the museum, it was like a really special, almost holy spot. And she would have never been able to believe that I have a restaurant here with her name on it. And turning the plate over, we're headed to Forged, a hyper seasonal eatery. We do everything as local as possible and like as sustainable as possible. Papas are a really special native fruit, banana, mango, passion fruit flavor to it. So we've taken it and made kind of like our own little banana pudding almost. I like this. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. This is good. We have a really great community, but at times, like things, there's a lot of sway in the restaurant industry. So having things like Maryland Restaurant Week give us a little boost throughout the month is fantastic. When it comes to foraging, they really show like the ecosystems that are happening. The moment that you can like go into the forest and actually see something that you can pick out, then you can bring it to your table. This is my happy food dance. Cara Burnett, WMAR News.